Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Tech Team Tronx channel, where we're going to tinker and learn. Today, we're going to install VMware tools in Linux using the command line version. The problem is I could not set the resolution to fit my screen at 1080p. So here's what I was dealing with. And I'm just loading into the operating system and then I'm going to try to edit my display. And as you see here, basically go up to try and change it. And then I apply. And the change won't take. Now in the previous video that I did the other day, uh, last night, I thought it was attributed to like software licensing, but apparently it's not. It's actually something else. Uh, this is where you would actually need to uh, install VMware tools in a Linux machine. So a Linux FX reminded me of this, and this is how we're gonna do VMware tools in Linux command line. So, we're going to update the apt package repository catch by doing a, a, the uh, pseudo apt update. So we'll go ahead and do that right now. All right, you want to do a pseudo apt update. Enter pseudo password. All right, and this is what it looks like. And it's done. Next, we want to install VMware tools. If you're without a graphical user interface, this is the way you want to do it. You would put sudo app install open dash VMware. No, app VM dash tools. And then this is. This will do it. You just want to hit yes to continue with the installation for the additional disk space. Now we'll take a look at uh, how to install VMware tools with a graphical user interface. I did both. It won't hurt a thing since I did both for this demonstration. So we'll just enter that command sudo app install open dash vm dash tools open dash vm dash tools dash desktop hit enter hit yes to continue for the additional disk space and you see it all getting done here All right, so it's all set. So next, we're going to restart the virtual machine for the changes to take effect. We're going to use a sudo reboot command. All right, the machine's rebooting. Get excited. Hopefully, this works for us. All right, so I'll go ahead and log in. All right. We're all logged in to our environment. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and like look for the um, the appropriate place. I want to configure my desktop and wallpaper, but before I do that, I'm going to close out of these system notices. And then I'm going to go to my system settings. And we'll see if this that does work. So I'm going to attempt to change the display characteristics to my liking. And Apparently it took. 
we could keep this. And then I'll just try to navigate my screen here to get it all set up properly for this configuration. And it's very pleasing and it's very much. And all this is free. This is, uh, this is you know, free stuff. It doesn't cost you a thing to do, just a little bit of time. So from now on, every time I do a Linux system on my virtual um, setup, I'm gonna have to consider doing this if I'm using VMware. All right, so that's all set. And voila, it looks beautiful. We're all set. Can't complain about a thing here. Um, so that's really it. If you got any questions, leave a comment. Thanks for watching type bill, you know. Um, be sure to subscribe and like the video on your way out. Thanks for watching.